Welcome to Solid Thinking Embed. In this video, we create an example for SPI to communicate with MCP23008 IC using Arduino Uno. First, let's select the target CPU as you know using the target configuration block. Now, configuring the SPI properties in the embedded diagram and assigning the pin values shown here. Using the SPI write block and assigning the Arduino slave select pin to make sure that the particular IC is selected to this pin. Enabling stop SPI bus can stop or deselect the pin at any point of time. Here we assign the address values where 0x40 is the write command of the MCP23008 and 0x00 is the address of the input output directory to write all the 8 pins. Selecting the blocks and then create compound block. Once the compound block is created and selecting the enable execution. So the first pass is a one time call function. It enables to initialize the GPIO direction of the IC. Again, we assign the SPA commanded blocks and then selecting the slave pin and we repeat the process. Here 0x40 is the write command of the IC and 0x09 is the GPIO address register and the other is enabled to the write all the 8 pins of the register. So again creating the compound block and then enabling the block. So this block is enabled using a pulse trying. So giving a unit delay pulse. Match block is used to compare the values. So here 0x55 and 0xAA are the alternatives 1 and 0 in the binary representation, which means the alternative 1, 0 is passed to the IC, which can be observed on the hardware board. So the pulse train is given with a delay of 0.5 second. So this is the SPA board. So we can see the connections shown. And this is the MCP23008 IC which is enabled using the jumper pins. So this is the Arduino connection to the SPI board. And now using the tools code gen compile and then download the program is downloaded on the board so we can see the alternative ones and zeros are passing to the leds thank you for watching this video